Welcome back lever monkeys. We're loading plates on trucks. I'm going to start off by widening our forks using one of the buckets on the ground. That way I just press down on it, slide it. If there's enough grease on the fork it'll slide fairly easy. This one I'm fighting with a little bit but it's slowly working its way over. Now we're going to start off, we've got a bunch of plates here that are covered in dirt, rock and whatnot. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick them up individually, separate them, and shake the rock off. The way I'm going to do this is I'm going to back up, slam on the brake, and curl real hard and get that rock and debris to come back towards me and slide down the plate. Yeah, I'm just going to stack them off in a clean area for now, a place that's going to be easy to pick up. Usually one side a little higher to leave a little gap under the plate to make it simple to pick them up. So we'll just repeat the process, pick up a plate, shake the material off the top of it, and stack it until we have enough plates to take to the truck. So when you stack your plates here, you want to make sure you get them as square as possible. You don't want to take them all, you know, crisscrossed and not straight when you take them to the truck, because then you got to correct each and every plate that's sitting on the truck. Alright, so sometimes you'll run into this problem where the plate just wants to slide. If you can't find something for it to run into to pick it up, the best thing to do is stand on your brake slam on the throttle and release the brake and that will break that friction that's preventing the plate from sliding onto your forks or the fork sliding under the plates. So I'm squaring up here. We're going to square up to the plates, pick up all three plates, and take them to the truck. Alright, now when you load the truck, you should have a spotter to help you out with squaring the plates to the truck. And that way you know you're not hanging off one side or the other. Alright monkeys, as you're separating these plates out and moving them around, you want to separate out the different sizes and make sure you're not stacking odd sized plates together. You always want the biggest plate to be on the bottom of the stack. So right here we see I've got one plate that's a little larger than the rest. I'm going to pull it out, separate it, so that way I can put it on the bottom of a different stack.
So as we turn in here, we see the truck driver has placed a single board in the center of the other plates and it's moved towards me. That way I can set the plates on top of the other plates and be able to get out from under it instead of trying to slide out from uh, a, a pancake. So this way what we do is we back up with the tip of our forks just underneath the edge a couple inches in, pick up the other plates or pick up the plates that you have. That way to take the pressure off that board, he pulls that board out, we'll now set the plates down and without all that friction of the whole fork being underneath it, it's real easy to pull out and not have to, not having the plates move around on you. I got one plate over that it looks a little bit, it's one size bigger than the rest. You want to get that one on the bottom first? Yeah. All right, so here I have a little issue. The oh, yeah. plate moved while backing out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna lift the tip of the fork up and touch the side of the plate and adjust it to where it needs to be. guys this is about where the GoPro dies on me so this is going to be the end of it I'm just going to get finished getting these stacked and then it'll just cut out on you so I hope you guys enjoyed got a little bit of information out of this sorry I haven't been putting out a whole lot of videos lately I'm still working some six days a week at uh, other locations so they're bouncing me around I just haven't found the uh, time and energy to be able to make a few of these videos so stick with it guys hang out with me leave some comments if you got any questions anything let me know in the comments below like subscribe if you're not already subscribed if you're not subscribed i don't know why so hit that subscribe button all right i'll talk to you monkeys later